Hey guys, it's a sunshiny day outside, so I thought we'd go on a little journey. A little journey to find a book. So to the library we go. Man, look at all these books. All these books I'll never read. Anyway, today I'm looking for a specific book. It's a new book called Letterman, about David Letterman. And the reason I'm getting it at the library is because it's like 30 bucks at the bookstore. And, um, and I don't have that kind of dough. All right, entertainment section. It's bound to be in here, right? Oh look, sick in the head, Judd Apatow, next to Bill Cosby, sick in the head, interesting. Alright, so they didn't have the Letterman book at the first library, so we have to drive to another one about 20 minutes away, just had a little bit, get a little gas first, and we are on our way, let's roll. Well, that, that got us something, I guess. Here we are at the other library. Hey, check out that cool checkers board. All right, this is a cool new section to the library that they just added. This section is all the books that Donald Trump has ever read. It's pretty neat. All right, I'm trying to look up the David Letterman book now on this computer, but the screen is stuck on this dog's journey. And it won't get off. I don't want this dog's journey book. Look at that, that's where they do the Today Show. Right there, that's where Al Roker does the weather. Picking his nose, picking his boogers. Look at this one. I guarantee he didn't catch that apple when it came back down. He's not even looking at it. Never enough. Or has it been more than enough? Aw, oh, cool. I'd actually like to read this book by my man Barry. The Audacity of Hope. Let's see how many pages it has. <laughs> 372, yeah. Not reading that one. Look at this. Speaking about books of important, famous people, this is my high school yearbook. Let's check it out. Crap. Crap. Not me. Not me. Hey, who's that handsome fella? It's, uh, it's me. Here's where I was voted shortest in the class. I sold that joke by hiding behind the newspaper. Blah, blah, blah. Hey, there I am. Cool. Blah, blah. Not me, not me. Hey, there I am at the prom. That wasn't my date, though. I don't think I had a date. Not me. Hey, look at this face. <laughs> look at this ridiculous face. Oh, boy. Not me. Oh, wow. My one and only wrestling match. There it is. Unreal. All right, well, I guess that's it. What did I come here for in the first place? Oh yeah, the Letterman book. All right, new books. It's gotta be in here. All right? Ha <laughs> ha, we did it. Letterman, the last giant of late night, all right. Let's check this book out of the library and get home. Job well done, everybody. Unreal, you guys. After all that, they won't let me take out the Letterman book. Because back in, like, 2012, I took out Austin Powers on DVD for some reason. I don't even like that movie. 
and I never returned it. So now they're trying to charge me 50 bucks or I have to replace the DVD. So I guess now we're on a new adventure. Let's go. <laughs> All right, as you can see, I still have the case right here in my collection of DVDs, but no, uh, no disc inside because it got stuck in my DVD player. So we're gonna have to go find a replacement for this, hopefully for no more than five bucks. And I think the second hand shop might be just the place. <clears throat> or not. That's okay. Let's go to the mall. FYE's bound to have it. All right, look at this. Austin Powers. See? Yeah. $13.99. I'm not paying $13.99 for it. $9.99. Unreal. I don't need the three film collection. I just need the first stupid one. Alright, Target's bound to have it. We should have just come here in the first place. Favorite flicks. Let's see what we got here. Bingo. Ugh. It's, it's the four of them? I don't need a four disc collection. $7.99, I just want the one. <sighs> Even freaking Walmart doesn't have the first Austin Powers by itself in a DVD for five bucks. This is ridiculous. All right, I have one last idea up my sleeve. I'm just gonna take this case back to the library. Hope they don't open it to see that there's no disc inside. And then boom, that Letterman book is as good as mine. Let's go. All right, let's return this stupid case. Get this Letterman book. Hope they don't open this up and call it a day. Unreal. The friggin' closed. <sighs> well, all because of Austin Powers. Couldn't get the David Letterman book we wanted to get, so I'm calling it a day. Oh, just gonna relax on the couch, see what's on TV. <sighs> you gotta be kidding me. Vlog over. Mm.